Hey, hey! <laughs> no. Oh, whoa. I almost choked. <clears throat> On nothing. And it's late at night, and now I have to record this and go to bed, because I have to work tomorrow morning. I worked today in the afternoon into the evening, so not a whole lot of time off for me. Alright, as you will notice, they thought that the whole facility was under attack by the Allies. You must have caused quite a commotion on the production floor. Keep in mind that Grandpa Jimmy is bad plus ass. He is bad ass. Your goal now is to scuttle the ship. Let's see, we have a daring plan that will destroy the boat but keep you alive. You know, Grandpa Jimmy could just hold his breath, go down with the sub, and then swim back to shore. I don't know why I gotta go through all this trouble. Radio your coordinates to the HMS Belfast, which is awaiting your signal. Uh, with the clock ticking, set the fin controls to dive and then destroy them, locking the sub into a downward trajectory. Blow the emergency ballast, which will surface the boat. Climb up and out through the conning tower before the ballast tanks fill with seawater. All right. Sounds like an easy enough plan. Today it was warmer and more humid than normal because uh, I don't know why it was warmer but it was more humid because a storm system was moving in hello I can see you through the wall that is rather uh, poor bathroom planning I would say <laughs> he's got his hand up on the wall let's see if I can kill him oh yes one shot one dead urinating dude that was in the how did that happen you saw the gun. It went right at his face, and he just stood there and took it like nobody's business. Oh, look. Hey, there's a dude right there, and he's not quite sure where that gunshot came from. Gee, I wonder if it could be from the other part of the ship. I got lost in this level once uh, when I was younger because I didn't see that staircase. What happened was I came through here like this, looked didn't see anything, backed out, turned around, and went looking and couldn't figure out where I was supposed to go. And, uh, whoa, what am I stuck on? Get through here. I hate the ladders. Ugh. Okay, where, yep, I knew there would be a guy. Ow. Stop. Stop. Stop shooting me. Oh, jeez. You can't go 360 when you reach the bottom. Yeah, so it was hot. It felt like a, a like a proof, a proofer. Whoa, hey. Don't you know that we're on a ship? Do you want to kill us all? Stow that gun. And try walking straight, dude. There we go. You too can die. All you need to do is arrange a one-time pass to Grandpa Jimmy Land. I think there is something wrong with my controller. I'm just holding straight up, but you'll see that I'm snaking left and right. It's somehow giving me this lateral... Whoa, hey! You were not very quick on the gun. How did you become an officer? Ah! Okay, I hate the ladders, I hate the ladders, I hate the ladders. There we go. Hi! Thank you for taking so long to shoot at me. Yep, thought you would be here. You're dead, too. One of the issues with this level... One of the issues that I really hate about this level is that uh, you have to get out of here with a certain amount of health. And it's such close quarters, and you're constantly having to deal with these people being in, like, right around a corner, or right when you drop down a ladder. Oh, crap. <laughs> That's not my fault. Somebody put a wall there. Twice. He's... Okay, I'm... This is insane. Plus, the best part is, nobody's even coming out to check. That hit the roof. That's not my fault. Let's try this a little bit easier. Okay, there. Perfect. Did that kill anybody? Probably not. Let's whip out the uh, submachine gun and just go to town on people. There you are. You die, you die. Stop using each other for human shields. I need you all to die. Just die. Anybody else coming? I don't see anybody here. Oh, thank you, Medicinal Canteens. You saved my life-ish. Get off the wall! Man. Transmit coordinates, and then it should give me... I thought it gives me a throbbing red box. I guess not. 
And I don't want to grab that first aid kit just yet, because I know that coming up here I am going to get shot by that guy. Just knew it. I called it. You all heard me. Why are you still alive? No, stop loading the gun and start killing the guys. Stop using him as a human shield. I hate that when they die. That's why I rely on the pistol so much, because when you shoot them with the machine gun, they have that slow death, and then they, their body, while dying, absorbs all of your bullets. Okay, that should be it for that. Fins have been locked. Throbbing red box has been... Uh, destroyed. Ballast has been released. There, I shot you. Stop it! The guy behind him sucked up that bullet. That first bullet went into the bad guy behind him. And because of that, I think... No, I should have just enough health to get out of here. Okay, let's get out of here. Please give me three stars. By the way, that's my favorite level in the game. When I'm not in a hurry to go through it and I do it uh, nice and slow. Video. The Unseen Terror is always the most frightening. And if you were aboard a ship in the icy North Atlantic during the war, you experienced firsthand the dread of wondering if you'd ever make it to port. From facilities like Daxmark, hundreds of German U-boats were launched to hunt in their deadly wolf banks. But the Allies fought back. Sub-hunting planes searched endlessly for U-boat periscopes, and when they found one, the results could be devastating. of which side you fought on, this would be a horrible way to die. I was just about to say that. Wouldn't it suck? Alright, 64% accuracy, which is terrible. 22 headshots makes me William Tell, and we get another secret code. So what was the whole point of my hot story that I never actually finished? Oh, let's save. Checking the memory card. What sucks, this... It's an emulator. It should be able to memory card real fast. RoboCop, for some reason, that is my original uh, save file. You can see it's 99% complete. That means I've beat... It's fully complete. Block used for uh, Street Fighter Alpha 3, and this is my 41% this current playthrough of Medal of Honor. I, uh, it got me thinking. Why? Because pants are hot. They're very warm and uncomfortable. Why do women wear pants? Why don't more women wear dresses? They used to wear dresses a lot. It used to be that you, all women wore dresses, but now they don't, and I don't quite get it. I think that would be cooler in uh, temperature-wise, not cooler as in awesome. What do we have here? Temperamental toxin. I think that is a weird uh, thing. It adds like motion blur or something to the level. So that it's like you're on, uh, you're drunk or what have you. Not entirely sure. But we'll get back to that soon. So if anybody has a girlfriend or a sister or someone like that, and they can ask them, why don't women wear dresses anymore? Skirts, you know, that kind of thing. Let me know. Is it hotter? I don't think it would be hotter than pants. Pants to me are really hot. I like shorts. Oh, what a weird note to end the video on. Bye-bye.